Hello there friends. So I'm here to do a plan with me and this is just after I finished planning this week. So this is recorded early in the week. So it's not filled out but I will show you this week because I didn't do it on camera. I did post a picture of this on my Instagram however. So feel free to check that out over there. I decided to go wrong wrong <laughs> because it was super cute with these florals. And this week we are also going to try to kind of match the florals but go a little go a little unique so this is the new student sticker book from the new line and these are available at michael's joanne's and on the mamby shop i think unless they've sold out <sighs> so i'm thinking because i'm just feeling all of the 90s vibes i want to do these super super cute like retro type stickers. So I'm going to use some of those. I also have the student like accessory pack and there's some quote stickers I'm going to use from in there. I have this sheet that came from one of the accessory packs that I might pull in another sheet with some stuff that I might pull in and then just the student like sticker book. I don't know, just in case. So I pulled a bunch of stuff and we'll see. I'm sure I will pull in like <laughs> everything else that I can possibly find as well. I also have the student like functional book for I don't know like these guys that kind of thing. So I'll go ahead and get my checklists down. It's going to be tough to find <laughs> enough of them but we'll do our best. So I'll go ahead and get those down now and then I will be right back. Let's go ahead and start getting some stuff down on the page. Okay, so first, I'm just pulling up my like a digital calendar because that's kind of my brain. That's kind of where everything <laughs> everything lives. They're a little different than I usually do them because they are a size for the teacher, so I'll have some more room to work. But I did a thing a few days ago and I started a Patreon, and so there's gonna be exclusive perks for people who join my Patreon and basically it's just to give some little extras and to kind of give back to you guys and there are different tiers so I'm really hoping that you guys like it and that you guys will come follow me over there as well because I would love to connect with you on all of the platforms so I will link that down in the description box below but make sure that you're also following me on Patreon now and there will be a cost for each of the tiers but the first one starts at a dollar per month and so if that's something that will fit into your budget I would love to have you following me over there for a dollar a month it also goes up from there all the way up to a hundred dollars a month so there should be a little bit of something for everyone but I also totally get it if it's not in your budget right now totally understand so yeah I'm really excited about it though and I hope you guys are excited about it as well and I was actually really inspired by planning with Kristen and Cindy llama letter Cindy shout out to both of them for inspiring me. I recently heard that Cindy was able to quit her full-time job. Not that that's anything that I would pursue. I love my full-time job because I work from home, but it is like pretty inspiring to see like how far her her platform has come. Okay, so just to kind of get back to planning after talking about that, I am just planning for Monday, June 10th. And so we will have a Delilah drop off. And then she also has a couple of fun things that day for school. So this is the last week of school for Delilah. So she just has school Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. And then yeah, it's done. It'll be completely done for the year, which will be cool. So we drop her off or Brian probably will. And then she has 
has a bowling field trip and they have field day, which is super rad. So I'm just gonna kind of fill in here with some of these functional boxes. I'm already really liking how this is turning out. It's super pretty. And I think that it totally goes with these florals that were already on the page. So love it. Okay, so let me know down below if you are out of school, if you're a student, or if your kids are out of school, if you're a parent, or just if school is out gener in general in your area. Oh no. Oh, I knew that was gonna happen. I don't even have very many of those stickers. Oh, I hope I did not just screw that up. I totally did. That sucks, man. <gasps> well, back to chatty plan with me's with a ripped sticker. I'm actually pretty bummed about that. <sighs> that sucks, man. I wish it had been like on the sticker where I could just like put it back down, but that's totally not gonna work. That bumps me out a lot because that's a really pretty sticker. Sorry guys, now you're gonna watch me peel up a sticker for a minute. <laughs> Man, that totally bums me out during this plan with me. Okay, but we're just gonna let it go. We're gonna release it into the universe. We're gonna remember that it's just paper, it's just stickers, it's really fine. I'm gonna try to not be sad about it. I'm gonna release it. I'm just gonna let it go, <sighs> but that is a bummer. Okay, so instead of doing that, I think I'll just pull a quote then from this other student sticker book and we'll make it kind of match. Maybe we'll do like a full box. Okay, let me see kind of need to see that like color palette so that I can make sure to match it or something that looks like pretty good. Stay close to people who feel like sunshine. That could definitely work. Be you, not them. Don't quit your daydream could definitely work too. Yeah, I think we'll do don't quit your daydream. Also that that shoe one could potentially work because it's kind of got all of those colors. Well, we'll save that one because I'm sure I'll pop that one in there too. I'm kind of combining like two different looks, I suppose. Oh, actually, I'm going to go with Stay Golden actually up there. I think I like that one better. It kind of goes a little bit more with the vibe that's happening here. Let's see. Okay, Stay Golden. Cool. Okay. Well, yeah, we're not going to be bummed about it. We are again, just gonna, just gonna release it. We're just gonna let it be. Do you guys ever do that where you like put down a sticker and then you have to take something up and then you totally screw it up. And if anybody answers no, <laughs> let me know how you do that because I'm pretty sure we've all done it at one point or another. Okay. So this is going to be back to Delilah. This is going to be for her little bowling field trip. And they were supposed to have field day on Friday, but on Friday of this week, but there's rain in the forecast. So they canceled it. And so we're going to have field day or they are going to have field day on Monday as well. So it's going to basically just be like a fun day. Then Tuesday, they're doing like classroom parties and cleaning up the classroom, like packing up, taking stuff home, all the things. Let's see. Then on, I don't even know what day. Wednesday she has like a fifth grade promotion it's gonna be so cute and then they're done then they're basically done so fifth grade promotion and then a picnic so that week is basically like yay let's celebrate and done <laughs> so that's basically how that's going and yeah then my daughter is a middle schooler that is so crazy to me that is absolutely wild oh okay and we're going to do all of the pen at the end I kind of forget like <laughs> how I do things. <gasps> oh, sorry guys, I am hashtag failing. Okay, so I am gonna put this sticker with all of the little friends, cause it kind of looks like her and her friends, you know, just hanging out, doing their thing over Tuesday and Wednesday. And yeah, it's just to kind of like celebrate my girl. I don't know, like this spread, I guess you could kind of call it like girls, girls time, girl spread, whatever. <sighs> But it's really, I don't know, it's kind of bittersweet to me that she's growing up, that she's that old, that she's such a big kid. Man, I remember when I brought her home. Okay, so I had to pop out for a minute. My little guy woke up from his nap early, so it's like several hours later. So if the lighting looks a little different, sorry, but I was talking about this sticker and how it just kind of reminds me of like all the things that my sweet sweet baby girl who's not a baby anymore is like embarking on and going through and like man oh, it's so much like if you guys are 
moms or parents or whatever out there in the planner world, you probably know exactly what I'm feeling and all the feels that I feel. That's where, that's where I'm at with it. And I don't know, like she is so beautiful. It's in, oh, it blows my mind like that she is growing into this little woman and she is just so smart and just like she I don't know like she's kind of like a bigger kid now like she has all these things that she wants to do and like all of these sounds weird to say but all of these like thoughts of her own you know like <laughs> I don't even know like she is just amazing. She's incredible. She's amazing So maybe one of these days I'll have her on for a video I'm gonna be partnering with a brand pretty soon and I think there's a video that I kind of want to do with her So that would be kind of cool. Okay, so back to our plans now that I've now that I have had like an emotional mom moment like I don't think it's a I was gonna say beans and monkeys, that's weird. If you've been around for a while and you're an OG, you'll know that's what my channel used to be called. Beans and monkeys, but it's not called that anymore. <laughs> so uh, what I was gonna say is we're going to have some more, like, I don't even, where was I going with that? I don't know. Okay, so back to our plans, back to our creating and chaos plans. So on Tuesday, we dropped Alila off at school, probably Brian, let's just be real. There is, one thing happening at her school. It's like classroom cleanup. So I need to make sure that I send her with like a bag or something so she can bring all her junk home because I'm sure, I'm sure like as the mama, I'm almost positive she's got some junk in her desk that she needs to bring home to me. So <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and plan accordingly for that. Oh, I forgot I had all of this extra space in here. Okay, well, maybe we'll do a bigger one than that then. Yeah, I was thinking you just had to there. Okay, let's do a bigger one because I used the shorter checklists. I'm telling you, it's been several hours since I was here last. So yeah. Okay, we are gonna do the Converse one and maybe, I don't know, we'll just put it kind of like this. And I'm not laying stickers down super duper straight today. You probably can tell, <laughs> but that's okay with me. I, again, if you're new to my channel, I'm not someone who's like a super stickler on how my stickers lay down as long as they're in there. I, of course, like every other planner person, want my planner to look cute. That motivates me to stay on task with things, but it's not like the end of the world if things aren't like perfect, if that makes sense. Okay, so that is done. And then we need, we take Delilah to school again. Man, we gotta take these kids to school every day. No, I'm just kidding. Taking her to school again this day. I'm gonna try to like stagger this a little bit. I kind of need this one to be at the top, but I don't necessarily love how that is looking. Maybe there are some smaller ones. Yeah, I'll do couple of these little smaller matte stickers. So these florals, there are two different types. So these littler ones, these are matte. And then these down here, these are like the clear stickers. I don't know, I kind of like go back and forth on which ones of those are my favorites, but you know. Okay, so that'll kind of stagger that out a little bit better. Okay, and then this will be a Delilah drop-off sticker and probably gonna need to use this shoes sticker here at some point because now I have a purple box. Okay, and then I need a smaller box. Maybe we'll go for some more yellow. We need like a... I don't know, what do they call them? Appointment labels? Just like a small one to mark her graduation. I am running low on those. I really like these, what are they? Like functionally type boxes that are from the student sticker book because they have little art in them. I think it's adorable. And right now before the pen, this spread is not turning out to be one of my favorites, but I almost didn't even want to say that because I feel like every time I say that and then I add the pen, it turns out fine, like it ends up being just fine. But right now I'm not loving how it looks. I think it'll be fine, but it'll be, yeah, it will be fine. <laughs> it is just a planner after all. Okay, so then on Thursday the 13th, summer vacation begins officially, officially a fish. And I don't think we have any plans. 
I have both kids home, so I should probably make some plans for the 13th. I still have to work. Oh, I forgot to put something in here. I have, yes, I'll probably mark that in my teacher planner, actually. Never mind. I, I was gonna put, I have like a work thing on Monday and Wednesday, but nothing else really. Okay, so is there, so in this student sticker book, I feel like I'm a little bit all over the place. I haven't done a chatty plan with me in a long time. As you all know, I was doing like the sped up plan with me's for a while there while I was on vacation. And thank you so much for all of your patience, all of your support, all of that. But now I'm back to doing the chatty ones and I'm like, well, I have to talk. Well, I get to talk. I really like doing the chatty ones better because I don't know, I feel like since I don't vlog or anything, it kind of gives you guys a little insight into my life, but it's like, I have to try to like multitask is the thing. So I'm clearly not very good at that. <laughs> so. so back to Thursday, we need like a last day of school or something. I think I might've already like used all those up because we are in that season. Let's see, that's like first day of school. Okay, used it up there. All, any of these teacher sticker books have it? Yes, spring break, summer break. Okay, I'll just use this little teacher sticker to mark that. And we have literally no other plans, like none. Let's see, I like this student sticker book that is seasonal. And I have two of them, but goodness knows where I put the second one. <laughs> Hashtag the struggle. I have like a billion sticker books over here right now. Okay, I'm gonna try something and see if it will fit. These stickers are size for the big. And I guess part of me wants to show you that you can use things that are sized for different size planners, no matter what size planner you're actually working in. Maybe I'm not, I don't know. Like I wanna use some of these big stickers but they don't really fit with this theme that I'm going for if that makes sense I'm kind of like meh maybe okay we're gonna pause on that for a minute I feel like sometimes and you guys can let me know if this happens for you too down in the comments I kind of get like stuck sometimes if like the spread isn't going exactly how I want it to go and I have to kind of move on to something else and then come back and then usually I have like something that I want to put there this is a pretty big space and we don't currently have plans that day we'll just we'll move forward to the week and I don't think I have plans actually any of these days. No, I don't know. Okay, well, let's just put in some of the deco pieces. So I know I want to use all of these because they're so dang cute and I just love them. Okay, so we'll put this girl right. Well, maybe we'll put her over here. Kind of like that. She looks like she's ready for the weekend. <laughs> She does. Okay, so we'll put her there and then we'll put maybe this girl there. That's cute. And then we'll do the other like shoes and music down the bottom. That's pretty cute. Okay, I'm kind of feeling it now. I do hope I have some other plans to like put in around here because I don't know I love the look of a full spread and I kind of hate it when like the first half of my spread is full and the second half is not so full let's go back to the calendar oh I know okay so the 16th is Father's Day how did I forget that so my dad is kind of obsessed right now with pho P-H-O, if you don't know what that is, it's like a Vietnamese noodle soup. And well, that is like a very bad explanation. I will like leave a link down below for how to make a homemade pho, but in Portland, we have like a pretty large Vietnamese population. And so it's kind of like a thing around here. And my dad recently discovered like how amazing it is. My parents always ate like just standard no, this sounds bad, but like standard Chinese food. And they never really like branched out. They've been trying some of the Vietnamese food and they fell in love with pho, long story short. So my dad, I don't know, he's been like having some hip pain and like, I don't know, kind of going through things. And so it's been hard to kind of like plan things with him, but he wants to go out to lunch and have pho. So I was like, okay, let's do it. So we're going to go have some pho. So I'll put that in there. That makes me happy that I have at least one plan. <laughs> and then I'm sure Brian just wants to like 
be home with the kids. Like that is his perfect day. He just loves it. He is like, shout out to my husband. Like he is such an amazing dad. He is so patient and sweet and kind with them. Even when I am not like I, I am so envious of his patience and I'm trying really hard to learn how he does it, but maybe it's different because I'm around them all the time, but he is so patient. He, uh, I don't know. He's just really good. Okay, so Fa with Dad is gonna go there. Saturday doesn't look like there's anything. And then Thursday and Friday also a whole lot of nothing. We do have a bill due. I could put that in, but that's kind of boring. Probably mark that. <laughs> And then I'll put in, uh oh, those are cute. Actually, those are cute bill do stickers. I kind of like it when, <laughs> when my stickers are cute. Like I'm like, okay, yeah, I'm motivated to do that now. So we have our water bill due on Friday. Oh, that's too much yellow. That's not gonna work for me. Let's do, I think there was like a blue one. Yeah, let's do that light blue on Friday. So we've got a bill due right there and that bill due sticker because I know you guys are gonna ask that came from the household sticker book which I absolutely absolutely adore okay so here's what we're gonna do here is what we are going to do we're going to on this Thursday we're just gonna throw down a sticker you know, that's just what we do we're gonna put down a sticker and we're gonna see what happens <laughs> and I do this sometimes. This is kind of one of my planning strategies because I really enjoy it when my plans, like my planner has like pretty much no white space, but kind of white space, if that makes sense. So I like to have spaces filled, but I like them to be pretty functional. I put things down kind of in advance. I'm like, well, I don't have plans now, but something is bound to pop up. Okay, and then I'll do the same on a Saturday because what I do, like if nothing actually pops up, I can either like use it as a journaling space, I can use it to track like what chores got done, but typically like something pops up, whether our neighbors come over, oh, okay. Yeah, whether our neighbors come over or what. I almost forgot because they didn't put this on the calendar yet. Or maybe I did. Did we put this on the calendar? Did I just totally fail on that? Oh, that's the Friday before. I was going to say we're having a date night, but that's this Friday. Not having a date night. <laughs> oh, but Thursday, pause. I do have plans on Thursday. I am going to be meeting a good friend of mine who I actually work with. We're going to be doing a little bit of work. Well, a lot for my new position. She actually is the current AVID teacher, like our only AVID teacher at our school. And she's amazing. And so we're gonna talk AVID stuff. And again, if you don't know what AVID is, let me know and we'll just, we'll talk about it. I love AVID, it's pretty fantastic. This is the last day for my students, but I don't think I need to mark that in my personal planner. But I do need to make sure that grades are all done that day. So that's when work and life is combined. <laughs> Okay, so now I want to put some more of those flowers just kind of in and around just to like fill things up. Let's see, were there those cute little laptops or am I, did I just lie to myself? <laughs> there are cute little laptops. I think, no, I'm not going to do that. I am, however, going to put in this cute pink composition notebook right here because it's cute like how can I not okay and then coffee I could put in a little coffee cup that would be cute since we're meeting at a coffee shop to do work that's the best kind of work okay and then I need to get a babysitter for my kids so I guess I do have stuff going on on Thursday who knew <laughs> who knew it, and yeah I'll just leave it blank for now I'll put like kids too and then We'll fill it in. Okay, so that actually looks really cute. So that's what it looks like before the pen. I get a lot of people who are like, show us your before the pen, because I never do. I'm not a before the pen planner. So that's before the pen. Ah, oh, there's so much shadowing happening. I hope that you guys don't notice that as much as I do, <laughs> because it sucks for me. Okay, so let's see. Oh, I wanted to put in some more of these flowers if I can fit them. They're kind of big, but maybe, so oh, I didn't bring my scissors down. Hmm, let's see. Well, I was gonna cut some of those long strands, but one of my lovely little children was using, were, was, were, using my scissors and I didn't bring them back down because I wasn't thinking about it. Okay, well, 
just how it is then. We could use, we could leave some white space, it'll fill up. And then because there's only one more of these, I might as well just put it over here. And I should probably just go ahead and use that white floral sticker also. That is cute. I feel like I should have put in another quote somewhere, but that's all right. That is okay. We'll use that last white sticker. And then that is a page of stickers complete. Is it just me or is that like a total Zen feeling when you complete a sheet of stickers? Just me? Okay, no, I'm sure. I'm sure it's the same for everybody because that's how we roll. Oh, and Tuesday, do I have room to throw down a little trash day guy? Oh, and I have a payday. Oh my gosh, I am struggling. <laughs> I have a payday on Friday. Oh, I think what happened here is I didn't get a lot of stuff marked on my Google calendar or, or like our shared home calendar. And so now I'm like, just like all off everything, trying to recall it from memory and it's just not working. <laughs> Clearly I am too old to recall anything from memory. That's okay though. But I like to just, I guess my like shared calendar with my husband is kind of like mental notes. And then, yeah, I don't know. It's just how it is. It's mental notes for me to, to put down in my pretty planner that makes me so very happy. Okay, so payday on Friday. We have a bill due and a payday. That's pretty fantastic. All right, well, I actually have payday on Saturday, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna get deposited on Friday. So I'm gonna put it there. All right, so now, now that we have all of this lovely stuff happening and we have a before the pen spread. Oh, actually, okay, one more, one more thing I think I need to add because I totally forgot that I had that extra space. I t my mind like stops right here, but I do have all that extra space. So I'm gonna put in some of those like longer floral stickers. I think that will like complete this spread. That's gonna look really cute. I should have just used up that space, but I think I was trying not to or something or like I didn't have enough going on, but now I do. Okay, we'll just put these in because they're so dang cute. Oh, I'm really excited now. That makes me really happy. Kind of wish I had done that on the other side too, but I didn't, so that's all right. And then we'll do one like larger pink one on the end here. That is cute. Yeah, all right. So now we'll put in the pen and I will be right back. minor brain fart. I tried to put the fifth grade promotion on the 11th, but it is actually on the 12th. Let's zoom out so we can see this spread in all of its gloriousness. Also, can we just take a moment and see how beautiful these lovely pink metal discs or blush or whatever they're calling them look with this very pinky spread? Like just... Oh, Take a moment, take a moment and take it in. Okay, so I love how this turned out. Again, I didn't think it was gonna be my favorite. It still is not probably like my favorite spread that I've ever done, but it's pretty fun and I kinda like it. And it goes with these florals down here. So I'm happy and it will be, you know, we'll turn to another week very shortly. So thank you all so much for your love and support. If you're new around here, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down below before you leave. And if you are one of my current followers, thank you so much. Also, don't forget to follow me over on Patreon. There's so many different tiers that you can choose from, so many benefits. So let me know if you do decide to sign up. Let me know that down in the comments below and it will be a blast over there. You'll get extra perks. But again, I totally understand if a Patreon is either A, not your thing or B, like it's not in your budget right now. So please do not feel guilty if you cannot 
donate to that. I appreciate you 100% no matter what, but it is really fun and I just wanted to share it with you guys as well. So thank you again. And if you wanna follow me on other social platforms, all of it is linked down below, but you can find me on Instagram where I post so many things, so many photos, and I love to be active in my stories. Twitter and Facebook as well. So <laughs> thank you again. And here's your internet hug for the day. And by the way, you guys have fun today. Bye.